We're about uh, 15 minutes north of the Freedom Factory, which is where Cletus McFarland, you guys know him from YouTube, right? He invited us down and said, come enjoy some freedom at my track. So he's got some cars for us to race, drift, just cause a ruckus. Good, you? Good. Welcome to the Freedom Factory. All right, so you guys probably recognize this guy, right? I think everybody recognizes this guy. Hell How could yeah. you not? I saw him from space. We saw him from like 10 miles away. Big old orange shirt out here. This is uh, Cletus McFarland, aka Garrett, right? Yes, sir. Hell Garrett yeah. McFarland? Oh, hell no! Cletus McFarland. Where, where'd Cletus come from? It's just... I just mean, like heavy D, it's same thing. Heavy D, yeah, yeah okay. it's the same thing. Right. It just becomes part of you. So this is the Freedom Factory. This is your most recent purchase. Yeah, it's our 3 8 oval that we bought that was abandoned for several years, and we've just been renovating it and bringing it back to life. So this place is rad. It's got yeah. the oval track. It's just like the ultimate like race car facility, and it's owned by this guy right here. Yeah, we're so gonna give like, you a tour. We're gonna yes. let you drive a drift car. We also got my drag car out, Ruby. Hell yeah! And we're gonna let you go for a rip and her. <laughs> Cletus just gave us the yeah, keys to his uh, hot right here. How you fit, honestly. Okay. Well, you got long legs, so. Yeah, there's a little bit of grass here. This guy in the helicopter just landed right here. <laughs> <laughs> You're lucky. I was gonna land on the on the, even closer. Ah, oh, we're golden. Oh, you're. It's yeah, like you actually fit really built good. for me. Yeah. Cool. You'll have plenty of clearance. So I didn't mean to be on. The how do you feel about this? No, you're good, man. Yeah. You're not nervous. I'm actually not nervous good. at all. Good. Good. I. I figure you've driven a lot more like gnarly stuff. This is a straight truck. line. Yep. So what could really go wrong? I mean, it's fast, I but those you got a parachute and stuff. What could, so. what could really go wrong? Let's not cut back to that later. <laughs> <laughs> what could really go wrong? Yeah, hopefully we don't cut. need it. Get ready to take Ruby down the racetrack. Uh, this is a seven second car. That means it can go the quarter mile in seven seconds. It's going to be a little bit of a, uh, a race to see who gets the best time down the track. Um, keep in mind that Diesel Dave and I do not have a lot of drag car time. AKA zero. Cletus is getting ready to do a little kind of test pass here in the car to make sure she's good to go really before bad. he hands her over to us. I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually pretty impressed with the guy. This is the first time I've actually met him in person and he's like, hey, here's the keys to my drag car. Go give her a rip and like just full trust. So that you know, that's how you win Heavy D's heart. Yeah, yeah, if you have something nice, up, you give him the keys. That's honestly, he's not wrong. Okay. Uh, basically, I'm just putting it in a spot where the boost isn't going to come in so fast that it makes the car wheelie because the last thing I want to do is hurt one of these dudes' backs from it going up on the parachute. So I'm just going to put it in a real safe spot. We don't want him to fly out, so these will keep him in. So he's got he's got a crotch bro. And Cletus has to reach down under the gooch of spark to grab the lap belt in order to hook up the shoulder sparky strap. Dude. They're getting to know each other really, really well. This yeah, the sparky gooch. All right, so.
<laughs> so how much is one of these? <laughs> oh. What do you think you ran? Oh, I don't know. It felt really fast. About maybe eight and a half. Oh, that was a 780. Was it really? 782. Holy <laughs> sh, dude. 100. Bro. Yeah, that was. <laughs> dude, that was awesome. You did a perfect job. Thank you. you really that, awesome. I think the car did all the work, but I'll take it. Yeah. Bro, that that, now I get it. I get why you guys do this. I'm that not going to lie. I've never understood drag racing. I've never. I've just never got it, but Dude, I get it. It's Ready fast. Yeah, that was, that was amazing. The shoot didn't, it, it kind of yeah. just puffed out, but. Yeah, uh, it does that, it does that sometimes. Wow, it's so uh, smooth. It's smooth and it's it's so, when you have a dialed in car, yeah. it's like. Bro, I've never been in anything that pulls that long and that hard. It just kept on pulling. It's just, I always, everything I drive, I always like, there's the, ooh, there's the yeah. dead spot. They I mean, just didn't have it. You're going like 60 mile an hour in a second. <laughs> you know, it's, so you moved 60 feet in about one second, you know, one no point seconds flat. That was cool, dude. I'm not going to lie. That was <laughs> super hey, really cool. Good job, thank dude. you. How did you feel letting go of that butt? Wow. Like it just really good. good. Yeah, yeah, except I always get confused by the lights. So I'm like, okay, I got two yellows. I'm going to get another yellow, then it's green. I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing. You did doing. a good job waiting, though, for the uh, for shift. The car, good yeah. job. Uh, Normally, yeah, people just it. smack the shifter. <laughs> that, was, that, was that was fun. I'm not going to lie. I'm, I, a little mind blown, dude? A little mind blown. A little, a little that excited. Makes happy. Yeah, that's, you got I mean, me, man. From a monster truck driver, it's cool to absolutely impress you. From somebody who's driven literally everything under the sun. And I'm just like, eh, you know. But that was, that was cool. That was amazing. All right, so I just did my pass in Cletus's drag car, and I'm not gonna lie. Let me let me back up a little bit. When I went into this, I thought drag car, cool, whatever. I've, I've done some drag racing, not very much, not in a nice car like that. So I didn't know really what to expect. But as soon as I left the line, that's a whole different ball game. I get it now. Like I understand why these guys are so enthusiastic about this. That was insane. The car just didn't stop pulling. I've never been in anything that fast in my entire life, as far as acceleration goes. Never. That was that was wild, but so smooth. It's my turn. <laughs> Zero three two was his time, so he's like uh, about two three tenths of a second slower than uh, Cletus and I. Where did he mess up? About the first three feet. Yeah. Unfortunately, <laughs> when he snapped the button, it just it could be a combination of things. Like the car is built for uh, adolescent giraffe like myself, so it, his foot came off throttle. Don't know if he was scared or if it just got him right. You know, the bald eagles will catch you off guard. They will. So he lost his time right there on the first sixty feet. But now Dave gets to tell him that he ran an eight. I'm so pumped. Hey, what do you think you ran? Eight seconds, tried flat. Really? Oh, nice. You didn't give job. yourself that much credit? Okay, maybe eight one. You were like a nine three. Nine three? He's <laughs> like, there no. you go. One seven five? You were right on. You went at eight on a hundred. You numbers at one seventy five. You, you went faster than all of us, 175 miles an hour. And Woo! Eight flat, pretty much. Yeah, really? It was eight, eight flat. Point, oh. But faster. I don't, you didn't yeah, you, go you, faster, but you went a little slower, but your, to get there. your you, butt came off the throttle right when you left. Yeah, I could feel it. I think it's because it pushed me back against the blanket <laughs> and I could no longer reach the floor. <laughs> to be completely honest, yeah, yeah. I was pushing as far as I, I can't reach. <laughs> now you recovered it quick though. Dude, honestly though, it's impressive that you guys will just willingly get in a seven second car <laughs> knowing it's turned up to do that and just send it. So I'll, I'll give you guys do a problem. it again if you want. Right? <laughs> <That's> awesome. <laughs> Don't twist this arm. <laughs> hey, you guys want to do some drifting? Yeah, yeah we want to do some drifting. It's the best day ever. <laughs> I'm like, hey, Cletus, you want to hang out? He's like, yeah, come drive my car and go seven seconds in the in the drag strip. And now let's go drift to the track. This is the greatest deal ever. We got to give him some helicopter rides later, but that's easy. Chicken uh, foot is when you leave the line and next thing you know, your foot comes off the gas miraculously and gets back on it because it's shook you a little bit. 
got a chicken footer on her hands. My chicken footer. <laughs> it's all right. I do great. <laughs> I'm not scared of that nickname. All right, get a video. Let us, he let us do the uh, the drag strip in Ruby, and now we're gonna go drifting. <laughs> and now we're gonna free him factories. <clears throat> this guy's whole, totally different vibe. It's a totally different vibe. This is just it's kind of like no hold barred out here. Now. This place is this place is the greatest. Freedom Factory is awesome. There's just every time we turn a corner, there's another awesome race car. This is go have fun. With Factory uh, second activity of the day. First we did drag racing, and now we're doing some drifting. Uh, as you can see, he's got this big open pad right here. Um, so doing some construction on the track. We're not going to drift around the whole track because obviously they got some asphalt ripped out. But I like this. There's plenty of room right here. They, uh, so they think we're just truck guys. And we are pretty much just truck guys, but we've had experience driving all sorts of different vehicles. So I think they were expecting us to, to definitely wreck on the drag strip. And when we went pretty fast, they were like, hey, what? So now hopefully we can impress them with some drifting. Suck. That was awesome. <laughs> this is, that was way more. Everything is way more fun than I'm expecting because I've done cool stuff, fun stuff in cars, but just it's just a different level. Everything is like dialed in. These yeah. guys know what they're doing. The Freedom level. Factory is not just a bunch of. I mean, they are a bunch of hillbillies, but they're a bunch of hillbillies who got their <laughs> dialed too. And it's uh, it's fun. It's my I've been watching Heavy D drift for a long time. I have to go there tomorrow. I, I just yeah, finished. See what I can do. Body style. Oh brother, that was on the whole time. <laughs> One rule, right? Pallet of grass. <laughs> one full pallet of grass, he says. One rule, stay out of the grass. Well, let's see what we got here. Oh, it's not that bad. Could be way worse. I mean, it could be better. He could have stayed out of the grass. Let's just go ahead and go like that right there. Yep, never happened. Freedom.
Freedom Factory. It's exactly what you think it is. Just full of freedom and full of awesome. And uh, we're definitely coming back, 100%. Disappoint. This place is a riot. His cars are awesome. His track is amazing. And uh, we're going to be doing some more stuff with Cletus here soon. We just ran the drag car. We just did some drifting. And now I just got word from my friend Cletus that we got the special invite to come run in the Freedom 500. 500. I think it's what it is. Freedom Basically, 500. he brings in, he goes out and buys like every Crown Vic police car in the country. Brings them here and then brings in guys like us, a bunch of other YouTubers and influencers. And we're going to race 100 laps around this track. So April 2nd, yep. I believe. And the last time we did it was a team race. This time it's one man, one car, yeah. 100 laps. So it's going to be on pay-per-view. Uh, it's going to be something you can stream and watch. I watched his last watch event. Win. It was literally one of the most enjoyable things I've ever seen watching his last event. So I would definitely recommend you guys stay tuned for that because we're coming to race in it. Going to be back down here. And... Uh, I'm pretty sure the party's just getting started here at the Freedom Factory between us now? and old Cletus McFarland. There you have it. That is our day at the Freedom Factory with Cletus McFarland. That man is a wild man. His man whole crew, he loves to party. This whole setup right here between his guys, his cars, his track, just dialed. Like way more fun than I expected to have. Way cooler bunch of guys than I expected to have. So this is day one in Florida in the books. Dunzo. Tomorrow, 